Have you ever had someone come up to you and guess your age, or have you ever asked someone to guess your age, and then immediately get offended when you don't like the result that they come up with? Because, honestly, that is almost my life to a T. Now, for a little bit of background info, I currently work as a lifeguard with the city that I live in, and throughout this job I have to both teach swimming lessons and guard public swimming. Now, this of course means that I am often in contact with children and teenagers, and for the life of them they can just never seem to ever guess my age right. It takes them like a million guesses, and there's only so many things that are realistic. Now. The reason that I'm talking about this today is because a couple days ago, I got quite the scare. Now, on Friday nights, I'm teaching a life-saving course, and while I'm teaching this group of teenagers how to save lives, I made a sarcastic reference uh, slash dad joke kind of thing, namely the when I was your age gambit, and then you insert the story kind of deal, you know, you know it, you know the one. Now, upon making this statement, one of the teenagers in this class raised her hand and seemed genuinely concerned. She was convinced that I was 26 years old. Now, spoiler alert, I am not 26 years old. But this guess on its own didn't actually bother me too much. It was actually a pretty tame estimate compared to some of the, you know, upper 40s guesses that kids would usually toss at me during public swim. But I still looked at her, really confused, and retorted at her, saying something along the lines of, Do you, like, really think I'm 26 years old? Now, at this point, I could really see this girl's head start to really focus, and I could see the gears turning on her thinking how old I could really be. Now, she still failed really bad, and this next one hurt me a little bit more. <laughs> Now, I thought I had really given all the necessary hints to, you know, get her to guess a little bit lower, but apparently those went right over her head, because as she gathers herself, she gathers her thoughts, she looks at me, and she stares me in the eye and says, so wait, are you like 35? And at that point, I had pretty much decided that we were going to be swimming a lot of laps later in the class to make up for this act of slander against my soul. But, like, I don't know! What? Why? Do I look that old? I don't know what it is about kids that they just can't seem to guess ages correctly. But honestly, it's a rare and appreciated trait for a child to actually get within three years of my age. But, I mean, hey, who knows? I might actually just look like a middle-aged man, but I didn't think I did. I don't know. As a general rule of thumb, please... If you are ever asked to guess someone's age, just lowball it. Reasonably lowball it. Now, if this girl genuinely thought she was lowballing me by the 26 and then the 35 after, like, oh, damn. But remember, lowball age guesses. It helps. Your life will become better. Now, anyways, that is all the time that I have set aside for this little video talking about my poor life story about being an older looking guy. If you've enjoyed watching today, hit that like button. If you want to see more videos like this one, or more stuff from me in general, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of my other videos. Now, anyways, I gotta go uh, put on some makeup or something. I gotta start looking younger. <laughs> Until next time, guys, uh, this is Celtic signing off. Have yourselves a casual day.